time, y'all. Down here in this, down here in central Georgia where it's hot, but it is not as hot as it has been here lately. I thought I'd check in real fast. Just got done getting my business off the ground. Got the paperwork done on it. Uh, I'll have, it'll be a fish probably in the next week or so. Um, I'll have my tax ID number and all that good stuff. Um, let's see if I can get this guy before he cuts me off. But uh, anyway, it's officially off the ground. We're past the talking part of it. I'm gonna start probably in the next couple of weeks start buying some of the equipment. And um, you know, go from there. And um, I tell you, I'm gonna say this again. When you have a when you have a dream. You have you have an idea in your head go for it don't let people i don't care if they're people in your family i don't care if they're, I don't care who they are don't let them talk you out of doing what you know you can do um just because somebody says oh we'll we're here to help you out we're here to you know to, to we're here for you but they're not they're not they're not really there for you they they just want to be they just want to be in your business you know they want to know what you're doing you know they they're not really there to help you you know so you know i call i saw a i saw a uh saw something this past week that really hit home for that it she was talking about an, about eagles everybody knows I love eagles. And um I'm not sure if it's true. I saw I saw it was it, the, the the thing said the only bird out there that will attack an eagle is a crow. Well, I've seen a peregrine falcon do that before, but you know, that's neither here nor there. But um hold on a second. Hey again. Yeah, what I was getting ready to say, I saw this video a couple days ago. Well, it was been over the last week or so I saw it. But it was talking about eagles. And this holds true to what what I'm talking about here. Um, I'm standing out here in my front yard in the shade. It's hot, but it's not blazing hot. But what I'm getting ready to say, it was talking about an eagle. And the thing said that a, a crow is the only thing that will... Uh, attack an eagle. All right, let's just say that's the truth. All right, what it's talking about is the, it said the crow will attack an eagle. Okay, but what the eagle will do, it, the the crow will get on onto the eagle's back and it starts pecking at its neck while it's in midair. So what the eagle does instead of fighting back, it soars higher. All right. Eventually, the crow will lose because it gets up to a certain height. Crows can't fly where eagles do, you know. And it'll eventually lose oxygen and it'll fall off. That's all the eagle has to do is just fly higher. And what it's the what it's what it think what it's trying to tell you when people are. These people are crows, okay. When people, when you got, when you're trying to do something, you got people either naysaying you, or they telling you to your face one thing, but in the background, when you as soon as you walk away, they're like, "Well, he can't do this, or he can't do that, or this, that, and the other." They're just crows, okay. Let them fall by the wayside, okay. What you do instead of fighting back, instead of you getting discouraged. And you getting upset and getting distracted, you stay focused to what you're doing, okay? And you just spread your wings and fly higher, because eventually, while they're sitting here, sitting here picking at your neck and you know 
pecking at you, trying to discourage you, trying to, you know, keep you from your goal because they didn't think of it or they see you're going to do better or you're going to become independent or whatever, you know. You may not, you may not open up a million-dollar business, you know, like somebody else did. Um, just, just don't, let, don't let people discourage you from that. So you spread your wings and you fly higher because eventually they're just going to fall by the wayside. They're going to fall off. And then you're just going to keep flying higher. You stay focused to what you're doing. Do like the eagle does. I live my life. I live my life. Number one, I focus on what the Lord was pleasing was pleasing, was pleasing to God. I try to. I do. I do my best. I don't. I don't. I fail every day. Uh, I get. I do get discouraged. But then I realize that, you know that. Um, I'm just trying to live please to the Lord but I, I live my life I look at like animals like eagles, lions, tigers stuff like that sharks um, mainly eagles and like lions and stuff like that I look at how they they're never discouraged they don't ever get afraid you know they a tiger, they could have hyenas. They could have five hyenas attacking them. And guess what? They're going to fight those five hyenas. And eventually, another lion is going to show up. And those two lions are going to take care of those five hyenas or however many hyenas they got. You know? One eagle take care of several crows. You know what I'm saying? They never back down. They have... A purpose. They have a purpose that what they're here for. God, God, God gave them all the animals a purpose, you know. And yes, they're predators. They're the top of the food chain of what they do. So, so I look at them not like so much as a predator, but how they how they do. You know, they they have a task and they go and they take care of it. And that's really how I look at it. A golden eagle. You know, a golden eagle, um, they don't back down from anything. A coyote, a goat, a rabbit. I mean, they don't, they don't back down from anything. You know, and they go and take care of business. And that's how I'm, that's what I'm trying to do. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to do this. And I feel like God has given me this idea to do, and this is what I'm going to do. And I want to do it to honor him. It's going to give me, you know, I'll be able to help people out and honor him with that and to serve others and to, uh, you know, give me some financial freedom. And I'll be able to be home every day. You know, there's a lot of benefits from it. So that's you know, why I'm doing it, you know, mainly, you know, so I, I can be my own boss, and that's one, that's just, there's just several benefits from it, but I'm just saying all this stuff, to, you know, don't ever get discouraged, don't let people bring you down, you know, if you got something you want to do, do it, don't let, you know, the comfort of a job, you know, um, discourage you from wanting to do something that you may dream of you know god wants us to be in, he wants to get us out of our comfort zones and um you know so he'll stretch your faith and stretch you as a person you know if you just believe in him you know and i'm i'm putting my trust in him you know even though i'm hanging on to my job i'm not gonna i'm not that stupid but i gotta get this i'm getting this here I'm gonna have this start having this stuff um, put together here for too long you know and um, start doing this thing you know you know I've let people in home my whole life just discourage me and I would just not do it well that's not gonna happen now you know um, I went to my attorney this morning when and I got with my attorney and, and got this stuff done he could do it a lot better than I could. I, I, yes, it cost me a lot more to do it, but 
it's done right. You know, and that's really how I want to do it. Uh, I'll let y'all in on what it's going to be at some point down the road. Um, but I'm just trying to get everything, get all my ducks in a row. And uh, But I just want to say that again. I know I said it last time, you know, don't about to, not letting people discourage you because, I mean, they will. They'll, they'll do it in a heartbeat. And um, there's a whole host of reasons why they do it, you know. So, anyway, uh, I just want to let you know that we, we did get it off the, off the ground. And uh, I'm keeping my job. Job's still going good. And uh, like I said, like I said before, it's a means to an end. And uh, that's really where we're at with it. Um, I'm gonna say something too about this whole drama thing I see, <laughs> I see on here. I, I I just find it hilarious, you know. I keep I watch some of it. I I, watch, I, I keep up with a couple of them. Uh, I just <laughs> I think it's hilarious. It's really more entertainment than anything. But how people can go on here and say you live on YouTube, you live on YouTube, you live on YouTube. Wow, they live on YouTube. <laughs> Uh, they're all mad at, at one, per, you know, a particular person or whatever, and then they have this alliance or whatever, and they can't even keep their own alliance together. <laughs> it's hilarious, you know. Um, I don't know. I mean, I said before, you know, and I'm not trying to do anything big on YouTube. This is really just a put you know i'm just doing this for entertainment just just for my just to do it you know, it's really if, if people watch it fine if they don't that's fine too where there's a lot of them that don't so you know if it gets seen fine if it don't that's fine too so uh but yeah this whole this whole drama thing it's just i just find it hilarious you know <sighs> i just know this uh I ain't trying to live that life. I ain't trying to live that life. If I was, I'd be handling a lot of the stuff that goes on there. I'd be handling a whole lot differently than a lot of these people do. You know, that's all I'm gonna say about that. So, anyway, uh, I just want to check in with y'all. Hope y'all having a good day. Uh, hope you had a good fourth. And uh, I'm enjoying a little bit. It's not quite as hot. We've been having a lot of rain down here. In, down here in this neck of the woods and uh it's hot but it's not as hot as it has been i think it's probably gonna rain later on we get rain late in the day it gets so hot and just so much so much humid that so much humidity down here that it's like it's almost like florida you know it rains in the afternoon that's kind of what we've been getting here lately so anyway anyway i hope y'all take hope y'all have a good day and uh Y'all take care of yourself. We'll see y'all. See y'all like sometime later on down the road when I start getting this thing put together, and I'll keep y'all. I'll keep y'all uh, abreast of what's going on with it. And, you know that type of thing. So y'all take care. See ya. Appreciate y'all.